guys, welcome, 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 welcome to Sonic uh, 3 um, and Knuckles, <coughs> so I'll be doing another cheeky playthrough, um, so no Disgaea this week, but hopefully, hopefully next week, um, we'll be back on Disgaea, um, so, without further ado, just bear with me whilst I, uh, Load up my own channel so I can see chat, and um, yeah, and we can get on with some Sonic uh, 3. Um, we just start a, a, a no save, so uh, you don't have to worry about me going through the special stages or anything. Everybody's having a good Friday so far. Um, and uh, yeah, hope you're looking forward to a weekend. was a way to set drop dash on this version. Uh, unfortunately I've not <laughs> set drop dash. But hey, maybe next time. Guess we can at least try and get 99 lives. <laughs> Yeah, I always prefer this mini boss theme. Always my favourite. Um, I, I think it maybe I should go a route that I don't normally go. Let's see what's going on down here. Nothing. <laughs> that is precisely why I do not go. Go down this way at least, I suppose. I think it'd be rude of us not to collect um, 200 rings as well. Bounce about. Where? Okay. What I meant to do was this. Get ourselves a fire shield, that'll uh, help for the boss. I think if we wait here, we get a bubble shield. Nice. <laughs> See, this is a stuff that I don't normally bother with. Oh, don't want the fire shield. <laughs> I do like the fire shield, but it gets extinguished straight away. to um, Act 2. The old uh, Angle is Land Zone. Again, I think I tend to take the lower route, so let's, let's take the upper route for once. Um, that's me. I was like to this cheeky little line. Okay, down we go. I think this gets extinguished, yeah. <laughs> I, I imagine it would be practically impossible to get every single ring. Is this a Tails only move? Does it lead to a Tails only move? I know we can get that. 
access to it. Unless there's a bit further on that can. Uh, let's leave a fire shield for now. There's a life up here actually. No, don't mind if I do. Hey Craig, how's it going? Exactly. Gotta go fast. Um, yeah, this is the game that... I've just shown what happens if you don't make the block. <laughs> but I uh, hope you're doing well, Craig. Happy um, Friday. And, uh, yeah, well done on FF8. You know what, because I hardly have a show off these tails roots, that's uh, a goat yard. <laughs> Got a yard fast, I see. Oh, sorry, I misread that, it's goat yard. <laughs> <coughs> there was a time when I, I did do a, a bit of a speedrun practice with Sonic Fear Knuckles just to. Um, Because me, Jasm, Cricken, and Lee Cumber were doing a race. <laughs> Unfortunately, I can't quite pull it off. But good times. Go, go a yard fast. Ah, merci. Hey, Niku, how's it going? Um, yeah, if you're not following Craig, he's doing some FF8. If you're not following Mabs, she's never late. If you're not following Niku, he likes to expect to rate. With Yoshi eggs. That's great. <laughs> Sorry, I swear. I'm trying my hand at. So, my friend uh, and colleague Mo was showing me uh, this guy who does like freestyle raps with like random words. So, we get like words from the audience. It'd be like egg, and then it'd be like Rubicon. Um, and yeah, it just does like a... And if you don't follow Infinity, it's also called Tate. Gotcha. <laughs> yeah, I, I think it's... Uh, I think I can do... Freestyle rap, me. I'm uh, not a typical... Rap artist. I can not group a con. Now that is a con. Yeah, sometimes I like to play Keepy Uppy with Tails. Just see how long I can keep him up in the air for. And you know what? I've actually left my coffee in the other room. <gasps> okay. I mean, it wouldn't be coffee time yet. What I'll do is we'll get through Hy Hydro City or Hydrocity. And then, my reward for beating Hydro City will be coffee. We're not getting the invincibility because the game is so... the music is so good. Mrs. I know, right? I know. My coffee. My coffee, it's strong like banoffee. I chew it like toffee. Because it's what gets me offy. I'm a lad from offy. And I like to charge no fee. <laughs> Spitting fire. It's my desire. <laughs> Sorry, I'll shut up. Um, <laughs> Don't go on. Oi! 
your right arm, I won't go on next factor, Gun has got talent. Because the prize pool was so much greater. Let him go. <laughs> Yo, my name's Jeff Yard, I let him cook because unlike Woody, I don't get him fucked. <laughs> I don't know the rest of the Kingdom Hearts characters, but if I did, you know, I'd eat a carrot. Shit! <laughs> that wasn't part of a rap, that was part of me jumping on a spike. <laughs> yeah, you've got cooking, you've obviously got riding, because, you know, some people, when they see a carrot, they don't think. That's what rabbits eat. They think that's what rabbits ride. Hey, come on! Okay, and that wasn't jumping into the flames. That's supposed to be a an insta shield. That uh, that wasn't a death. That was a um, an example. Um, why am I playing Sonic Fiero over Origins? I prefer it. You can customize the music. So I can set the Sonic 3 mini boss theme in the Sonic 3 section and the Sonic and Knuckles mini boss theme in the Sonic and Knuckles section. Uh, it has the original music for Carnival Night Ice Cap Zone and Launch Base Zone, which I prefer. Uh, and um, overall, I think the, the options available in Sonic 3 Air are better than Origins. And also, Origins does tend to chug a little bit on my PC. Now, um, I, I do like Sonic 3 on Origins. I think adding the uh, Big Arms boss in Launch Base Zone was cool. Um, oh shit. <laughs> okay, I guess we don't get this glitch in uh, Sonic 3 Origins where my screen locks at the top. <laughs> but, um, yeah, um, I, I do tend to experience a, a few more glitches with... Okay. You know what? People always say, can I do a blindfolded run of Sonic and... Sonic 1. Let's see whether I can legit do a blindfold run of Sonic via... Or is it legit not... Can I not get any further? Start the act. Uh -oh. That's my cue to get the coffee. Now I've got a wall chasing me. <laughs> Thanks, Niku. Yeah, so you know what? Sometimes, Craig, on a Friday night, I have to show people how not to play so that they can come up to me and be like, oh, Jeff. Thank you for showing me what not to do. Now I know fully what to do. Yeah, you know, I, I find blindfolded runs impressive, right? Um, I like blindfolded runs of Mario, um, and, and primarily that's the only one I've seen. But more impressive, I think, and blindfolded runs for a different reason is when people fake blindfolded runs <laughs> because I wouldn't tell I wouldn't be able to tell the fucking difference but <laughs> there were people on online who like <laughs> who like do a blindfolded run and we've got like they can see through the blindfold or you know it's pre-recorded or, or something and there are people who are so familiar with the game who can do like this dossier on all the <laughs> all the intricacies and all the fuck ups that we've done. <laughs> and then you've got like the apology video of this guy who's like, oh, I'm sort of, you know, this, this person, guy, man, woman. And he's like, I'm sorry to fake a blindfold. It's a. <laughs> I don't know, it's just a um, sort of. Um, perverse pleasure, I suppose. <laughs> I wanted to do a blindfolded run of Niku. I believe you can do a blindfolded run of Outlast. Ah, dude. Uh, 
Um, yeah, so far this is the um, this is my blindfolded run of Sonic. And if you don't believe it's blindfolded, the evidence is how many people have you seen fuck up this section? This simple section. This simple easy peasy section that I could do with my eyes closed. But evidently I can. And that's my truth. <laughs> maybe, maybe. I think perhaps after we do Sonic 3, if we ever get to the end, um, I'll, I'll do a blindfolded run of Sonic 1. Or I'll, I'll do it with my eyes closed at the very least. Um, obviously I don't have a can, so you're probably like, how are you going to prove it? Um, well, you're just going to have to take my word for it, but it won't be submitted or anything. Maybe we could do that just as a bit of funsies. Reading chat telepathic. Oh shit! Um, yeah, so um, you, you think I'm reading chat telepathically, but what I've got is I've got a headphone in that, and I've got like a, a text to speech, so it's reading out chat to me. And that's how, despite my blindfold, I can see. Or here, rather. <coughs> so don't don't you go figuring it out. Uh, yeah, so Air is uh, Angel Island Revisited. Um, A-I-R. It's like a, a mod for Sonic 3 that has uh, widescreen support um, and, and additional options. And hey Tate, how's it going? We were just rapping about you earlier. There, uh, welcome in Kendall. Hope you're doing well. Anyone see my camel? Ah oh, shit, I keep me right, okay. Coffee time. Now, we've got a cutscene. I'm gonna grab my coffee. That'll be two seconds. As it's a disaster. Not only was my coffee um, not in the next room, but it was um, downstairs. Uh, so tautology is the saying of the same thing twice over in different words. Um, so essentially, it is repeating yourself, but using. Um, uh, uh, a different term of phrase. And thank you, Mabs. Thank you, Nikki. Miss you guys. I did, I ran, I, I was inspired by Niku Naughty. Stop watching the stream right now and get on the game and play it to completion. But don't laugh, don't use that emote. That's not getting on the game, is it? That's laughing. That upsetting me. Don't know if you ever beat him again. I don't know if you'll ever be in the, the greatest game to grace this planet. <gasps> <gasps> well, I 
Never. Die for it. <laughs> I, I just had to lose my shield due to this shot. I am shocked and appalled. I'll try to continue on with the stream, but I don't think I can. Sonic Rush count as 2D. It does. But so does playing Sonic not in a rush. <laughs> but dum tush. That's a, that's a, a funny joke that I've been working on all this day. How do you see the emotive and blindfolded? Because my text to speech has. Iku Senpai has used the. Lull emote. Plus, 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 when text to speech says capital L under uh, lo lowercase u capital L, I know for sure it, when it's like te my text to speech goes lull. No, wait, it goes lull. Uh, that, that's how I know that he's used uh, the laughing emote. Hey Arch, how's it going? I did, I got the, uh, they had a new barbecue meatball sub out today, so I got that one. It's, uh, it's very nice. Uh, yeah, if you're not following Arch, he's playing some art. Definitely check him out. It is Friday, and that means that we say to Arch collectively, we love you. We appreciate you because um, I forgot how my song goes, but Love Arch on a Friday, that's the end to it. Lose everything during the purple ocean area. Ah, fair enough. Um, actually, Niku, what you uh, mean to say is you lose everything during Oil Ocean Zone, and <laughs> Oil Ocean Zone is not part of Sonic Fear Knuckles, so uh, get your thoughts straight. Uh, have some, uh, <laughs> have some good feed. <laughs> Sorry, I'm, uh, I'll, I'll stop being a dick. This is, uh, no, this is, uh, this is uh, the lack of coffee that's getting to me. You forgot I'll play David's song. Hey Jasm, how's it going? Yeah Jasm, it is, it is. And, you're probably going to say, um, how do you know that Jasm subscribed? But, my answer is, I've got a, an alert that goes off in my ear when there's a subscription. And it goes a little like this. <coughs> Why do Jasm's? Suddenly appear every time Jeff is near to Marble Garden Zone. He's on his own, but not with Jasm and a scone. So that's how I know. Thank you, Elfinity. That is not true. Uh, uh, Jasmine, my singing is angelic. Thank you very much. Are you describing my voice as the Resident Evil 1 basement theme plus the Sonic Spinball Options theme? As that is an affront. It's a good song, Gamma. It's a good song. You know, we do like video games live, but we never do like the Sonic Spinball options theme in video games live, do we? But yeah, I hope you enjoy your meal there, Kendall. Sounds good. 
<laughs> Monkey tails. See, I've not defeated tails all stream. Uh, da -da. Now, um, we were. I, I was considering doing a a blindfolded run of Sonic One and I reckon I could get past Green Hill Zone Act One. <coughs> I think Green Hill Zone Act Two would be maybe I could make it to that little platform section. So I'm trying to think what I think if you get past like the first, those two first jumps that stop you going to a lower level in Act 1. There's not really a lot you can die against as long as you collect rings, right? Um, <coughs> who knows? Yeah, I do like um, Sonic Spinball. I even like um, the options theme to an extent. Uh, at, at least one part when, when you leave it a while, it goes into a nice little melody. Oh. <laughs> I can. You know what, Jasmine? I, I don't have corporeal form anyway. I'm actually just a floating head. Yeah, it's Niku, I say that not because I'd want to bully Tails, but because I think Tails should reach for stars. Right? <coughs> so, what you're hearing is. Oh, Jeff's bullying Tails again, but what I'm saying is, Tails, you show, you show us what you're made of. As S Club 7 once famously sang, Reach for the star. <gasps> Niku! Come here, Tails, don't listen to Niku. Full of shit. Full of shit. Is this because I dissed you about oil oceans? And I'm sorry. It's a yeah. It's a. I think the purple water level is an apt description. And if I knew what I meant, it meant that you conveyed the message correctly. Actually. <coughs> You're all suffering inflations! Are you a balloon? Okay. Oh, sorry, you meant the channel point inflation for me saying hello. I gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> the Tails No Jump Challenge. <laughs> See, look. This is why I don't want Tails plugged. Walking, so that it can take me to the worst zone. Okay. Hopefully, I can remember my my race techniques for this level. Okay, maybe not the worst zone, but the worst music. There we go. I think there was another shortcut somewhere here. Ah, okay. Ah. Wait, I've got a flying fox. <laughs> Tails fly me.
Um, I can do the slots if you want. If you want. Um, yeah, I, this is actually a save that I've loaded, so I do have all the emeralds. Don't know why it's not playing any super hypersonic music. But yeah, just in case you were. The trick is to make the sign fall faster. It's supposed to head up. <coughs> Who went super first, Sonic or Goku? Do you want to know the answer, Niku? It was you. Nice. Because you were born super. See guys, I can be kind when I want to be. No, you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Move Master, how's it going? Put one in. Wait, no, don't want the bubble shield. Ba da 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 da. <laughs> Jeff Yard, he can really move. Jeff Yard, he's got an attitude, but he does. Oh shit, I did want the bubble shield. So that I can go down here fast. Okay. But I don't think I need a bubble shield after. So that's fine. So, uh, yeah, that is a, a speed running gather. If I were to do a casual, uh, sorry, a, a glitchless speed run. I'd want to lose a, a bubble shield about now. Ah, nice. <laughs> yeah, doing the insta shield allows you to skip this little section. Uh, this, well, it allows us to skip a section that we did skip. Uh, but falling off there just loses the time that we would have saved. <laughs> so, um, there you go. Hey, Super Sonic, how's it going? Oh, come on in. Hope you're having a fantastic day Okay, so, hey Ashua, how's it going? Hope you do, I hope you're having a... Can you describe how the section looks? Yeah, you go left a bit, then you go up a bit, then you go right a bit. And you know what? I, I just realised that <laughs> for all the speed to improve the level that I could have done, I could have just turned bloody hypersonic and sped through it, right? But sometimes I think it's worth playing the game without. Hypersonic. I 
Oh yeah, this is a tune. Well, I think as punishment for you guys not believing that this is a blindfolded run, I might just take away the tune and sing over it. Yeah, so um, actually we're just doing a blindfolded run at this moment. You're probably like, but Jeff, you've not got a camera and you're reading chat. I've explained this all thoroughly. And uh, yeah, I think the fact that it is a blindfolded run and my um, my approach is beyond reproach. A moderately tolerable. Oh, Jackson, you're not moderately tolerable. You're thoroughly tolerable. Thoroughly tolerable. Shit. See, you can tell it's blindfolded because. I fucked that a bit up. Twice. Well, blindfolded, uh, can you see through time? Or is that not till Sonic CD? Uh, that's not till. Oh, you know what? I keep meaning to buy Sonic Superstars. I should play that one time, though. No, Tails! Tails is here in spirit. I think this is a pre recorded stream. This is not a pre recorded stream, Arch. Does this look pre-recorded to you? Does this sound pre-recorded to you? Am I a pre-recording? Should I change my name to... You think he's right? You think he's right? Oh, I beg to differ, Mr. Insert username here. This sounds like Jeff 2022. I am Jeff 2024. This is New Year, New Yard, and you're probably thinking, Oh, but the New Year does not start in April. Well, my New Year does. It starts on the 19th of April, specifically. Specifically. Guys, why don't you just believe me? This is a live, blindfolded run-through of Sonic 3, Angel Island Revisited. He thought we wouldn't notice. I wanted Tails to fly. Oh, too late now. We're walking in the Oh, uh, sorry Nico, missed chat. Uh, they had PS5 as Superstar... Superstars is so good. <laughs> sorry Nico, I completely missed all of that. Uh, they had PS5 as Superstars on that Sonic restaurant pop. Ooh. Oh, that's awesome. Uh, went with wee mum and your nephews and brother-in-law. Oh, nice one. So was that like a a limited time restaurant thing? Because uh, I saw, I think they were doing a Square Enix pop-up event in, uh, I think it's either LA or San Diego I saw. I think we move from place to place. Alright, well hopefully one appears in Stockport tomorrow. You know what I was going on? going on about my coffee for like the past half hour? I'm not drunk yet and I can see it looking at me. It's getting cold and lonely. I think my reward for the ice cap zone will be to drink the coffee. St 
still out in Cali, but I don't. Ooh, nice. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Did he get his autograph? I want Sonic's autograph. I want pictures of Sonic. Next tails. Woohoo! Hey, next, how's it going? Oh, come on in. Have you got any photographs of Sonic the Hedgehog? Just work it. Oh, I hope work goes smooth. Got a photo of him at Alton Tat. Oh, yeah, because they had the Sonic Spinball ride, didn't they? Is that still uh, called Sonic Spinball? Now I'm going to drink my coffee. This is also one of my funkiest levels, one of my favourite levels. Ah, my Sonic. Oh well, it is good for a time. <laughs> Go where with the options being blaring. I mean, obviously you would have done that anyway, right? Again, not get me invincibility because this song is too good. But when we get to Sandopolis, then we can get me invincibility on. Oh, um, yeah, as I was saying earlier, I've been uh, practicing becoming a, a, a rap artist. Um, so, um, if you ever see me become famous in future, I'll, I'll be happy to, to sign your autographs. I'll be happy to say hello. Happier still to, to give you all a, a pat on the back. Yeah, exactly, a rap yard. And just to give you a bit of an example of, of the rhymes that I'm coming up with, it's, yo, I've got my friend Arch, like potato, he's full of starch, and you think that he's a patriarch, but no, he's not. He's more than that. He's a larch. And if you want to know what a larch is, I don't know. But I'll think about it. This. Week. End. Because he's a friend. <laughs> yeah, we could get some custom map yard merch. I'll be, uh let you have a photograph of <laughs> definition latch. I hope it's nothing horrible like poo. Okay, it's a tree. It's a tree. European latch. The leaves are light green, soft and needle-like. So, yeah. I've got my friend Arch. He's full of potato starch. He's tall like a latch, and he's got a big heart. Okay, so if, if you see Dr. Robotnik there, I don't know whether it does it in this version, but 
If you take a second controller and get Tails to hit him 255 times, or it might be 256 times, he turns into a Flicky, like a normal enemy. Uh, but you've got to get Tails to do it. Uh, at least on the Mega Drive and Genesis version. So, there, there's, your, there's your trivia for today. Have I ever done it? No. Current Jeff wouldn't tell us secrets. Is it? I no. Current Jeff does tell you secrets because Current Jeff has just told you a fucking secret. Yeah. And and if this was. Prehistoric Jeff and only current Jeff told secrets. Then, um, actually, that doesn't work in my favour. But the point is, I am not 2022 Jeff. I am 2024 Jeff. God. What's my national insurance number? Well, that's not going to change depending on on what year it is, is it? It sounds real def I am Yeah, I'm real defensive because you, Infinity, have been a real idiot. <laughs> Starting 2024, Jeff is busy being... Uh, uh, avoiding the question. I answered the question. That's a personal matter, and I don't think giving away my national insurance number would be of any assistance. Too busy riding. Yeah. I'm riding. I'm cooking. And I'm looking. Try to discover a little something to make me sweeter. Oh baby, refrain from breaking my heart. I'm so in love with Tate, and it breaks my heart. Why does he have to give me another bloody reason to make me have a fart? Just wait till you catch up, you're gonna love FF7 Rebirth. <laughs> this is Jeff Yard. <laughs> Coming Jeff Yard is still after to look forward to FF7 Rebirth. Thank you very much. Shit. Let him cook. <laughs> 2034, exactly. And we've got the FF16 DLC coming out right that I'm, I'm, I'm not being able to to enjoy. See, this is fun. You know what, it's been a really good couple of years for Final Fantasy fans, I think. Um, I think there's been a bit between Final Fantasy um, 7 Remake, Rebirth, Final Fantasy 16, Theatre Rhythm, Crisis Core, and the um, additions that we've done to Final Fantasy 14. And, and the Pixel Remasters, actually, which... Uh... I 
We're all loving rebirth, right? This is a. Uh, maybe I should have called it Sonic Free Rebirth or Sonic <laughs> Free Birth. Um, but I didn't. Sorry. It's my mistake. But you know what? When I make mistakes, I can hold my hands up and say I'm sorry. Rebirth. We girthing in there. Bonjour! Look at her bazongas. Been playing with DLC. Oh, is it cool? Hey, so, so how's it going? Yeah, uh, I, I saw Panda was uh, playing a bit of it and Saber as well. Oh, thanks for the uh, bit, so, so Much appreciated. Uh, yeah, if you're not fun Soul Star, he's doing some FF7 Rebirth. Okay, I could never beat this boss as a kid. He used to scare me, especially with the darkness. Days This and the underwater levels. <laughs> yeah, this is a, an old save, or a, a, I guess new game, plus whatever you might want to call it. Um, so yeah, it's still got all my lives. Hey Anus, how's it going? Alright, uh, Anus, you'll be pleased to know that I did watch the Uncle Albert clips. Where <laughs> the ladies at the bar, the French lady, and they're like, "Oh, she's German," and then Uncle Albert goes down, and he's like, "What is your name?" <laughs> it made me laugh. <laughs> what is your name? You're having me on, you dipstick. <laughs> and then I watched like other Uncle Albert clips, and he's pretending to be horrified. Uh, at Rodney. Just like, <laughs> Good times. Okay, so one thing I do like to do is... Sorry, Tails. Yeah, thank you, Jess. <laughs> I can't shift to your looks, I know that. But you know what, it does feel good to not have to worry about the special stages in this level. See, all part of a blindfolded one, guys. To do a special stage ring at the start of this level, we load them and do a different one. Oh, interesting. I presume that'd be the second time after playing it, right? Because um, I know the special stage rings don't reappear the first time. I know when I was doing Sonic Mania and trying to get all the Chaos Emeralds, 
I used a um, chemical plant zone to grind out the, the emeralds that I needed. <laughs> Where I think there's quite a there's a, a special stage fairly early on in Chemical Plant that's pretty easy to access, so that's how I did that. I'm impressed with Sonic Mania overall, to be honest, and um, yeah, hopefully we get a, another game in a, a similar vein to it in one day. That's cool. Yeah, um, but what were your final thoughts on that game? I, I wouldn't know that because 2022 Jeffy is not here. If you were to ask um, what 2021, uh, 2024 Jeffy wants, uh, then I, I'd, I'd say go, go Tim Martins. Take a wild pick. Cheat yourself. Get the most expensive one. No, it was a, a, a slip of the tongue. I wanted to say get any one you want, and uh, that is my intention of, of what, what I was going to say. Uh, because I had the word one in my head when I said 2024, I accidentally slipped and let out 2021. You can note it all you want, Arch, but it ain't gonna change my mind. Right, DQ, it's so good. Um, yeah, the, the guys. Uh, who worked on the soundtrack and, you know, currently, uh, T Lopes as well, um, on, on Summit Mania. Uh, yeah, they've all been great. I think it's warm enough for some ice cap. Awesome. Not 2021, anything but that. <laughs> yeah, now this is a tune. Shit! Um, so for those watching, that's just uh, an example of how the fire shield can lead you astray. And uh, how to take care. No, no, anything but that. <laughs> It's a small world after all. I'm watching blindfolded. The cat was bitching at you. Go tap. Uh, uh, yeah, welcome back, Anus. I, I was just saying, I did watch a clip of um, Uncle Albert um, speaking German. <laughs> going, what is your name? <laughs> Uh, yeah, it is uh, yeah, very funny. Shit. As soon as I put your crocs on, he meowed at you in disgust. Oh, good cat, good cat. It was my favourite clip until I, I decided to watch more of Only Fools and Horses clips. Uh, and it's my second favourite Uncle Albert clip, but my favourite Uncle Albert clip 
was the one where um, he's supposed to act in disgust at Rodney coming in potentially having a new girlfriend. So Rodney comes into the house and Uncle Albert's just there like <gasps> and Terrible's like, not yet, not yet you <laughs> And it just keeps going on like that. It's yeah. I can't explain it but uh oh, you know, any explanation wouldn't do the scene justice. Oh it's um uh, Only Fools and Horses. Uh, it's a British sitcom. Uh, And then I was watching a bit where with Grandad when we're pretending about the spirits. <laughs> I don't know if I'm allow, but yeah, I'd suggest if you get the chance to actually um, watch a few clips on YouTube. It's funny. There's a be prepared joke somewhere. That is a good song. Let me up. My tails don't jump on me. I'm just saying I did not do that to Tails, he did all that entirely of his own volition. Oh yeah, I guess it does, right? Not that I'd ever make it that far, that bloody... Second level. in my bottom. These things are making me crave fun. What's a Funyun? I want a Funyun. What's a Funyun? Oh man. Music's gone. I was just going to Google Funyun. Why do you get a Funyun? Onion rings. Oh, I see. Okay. An onion. Maybe. I thought I have an onion. The lyrics to this song are Come on now, Jeff wants a funion. And if I had a funion, it'd be lots of fun. I could chill about in the sunshine. Do do do. <laughs> Sorry, I'm sure. <laughs> I'm sure you're all begging me to do so. Okay, let's get off onions. We have flaming cup. Why do you get funions and we get non funions? Do we get funions? Do we have funions? Because it's a fun onion ring. It's a funion ring. <laughs> I want a funion ring. How do we get bun boring onion rings? How do we get boring onions? And cut. <laughs> I want to cut, but I want to cook a funion. Bet the guy who came up with that name was proper patting himself on the back, right? Going to the marketing department, like, right, guys, let me cook. Look what I've got. It's an onion ring, and we're gonna call it funion because it's a fun onion. Give that guy a raise. Oi, bruv! British on your wings uh, on your wings of panther. Two. 
suppose a British onion ring would just be coming up at you like, yo, do you want some water? <laughs> some water with your onion. Deep fry banter. <laughs> and it comes with a few cheeky Nando's. <laughs> Our onion rings takes you to spoons on a Friday night. Starting on me, bro. No, it's banter. It's banter. It's only me banter. Speed is setting up in Sonic V. Uh, one of the nice quality of life features. Oh, Jasmine, how was uh, Street Fighter 6 yesterday? W were you playing with pets? I would have been tempted to play with you, but not in. I, I had to uninstall it because I think I had to install FF7 Rebirth and Tekken 8. <laughs> One day I'll get back to it. One day. Oh wait, we might be able to get 200 rings here. No! Okay, good. <laughs> I thought I was gonna lose it all. Ty JP, nice. Oh yeah, I forgot you've got Takadate as well. There you will. And Sonic with Fighters, of course. <laughs> Bet Robotnik has fun, you minks. Bet those spiky things are funions, aren't they? Oh, you know what? I don't want, don't want you, sweaty, biffy, robotic bunions. Okay. Yeah, I've still got a Divi Arcade quest mode on the Tekken Eight. And I've still got to try out Eddie Garda. Unfortunately, I cannot remember the fast ways through this level. I think this is probably my least favourite level. Uh, it's not a bad level. It's just a... I don't know, when you've had the dizzying items of Ice Cap Launch Base, Mushroom Hill and Flying Bat Train to come into this. You call it Sandopolis, I call it Blandopolis. Haven't gotten this far, fair enough. You know what, Nico, don't blame you. You probably saw the level and you were like, you know what? Let it cook. Representing the. You know what, guys? I think it's okay to enjoy Act 2 of Sandopolis. Isn't it okay to enjoy Sandopolis and Jen? I think for me, because. This is like the ninth zone now, isn't it? <laughs> And I, I guess if you're playing through, you've played through quite a, you know, you've essentially played through like one and a half Sonic games at this point, right? Um, <laughs> so, uh, and then coming into this, bleh, I don't know. So. I think I get reinvigorated by the time I get to, um, 
by the time I get to Lava Reef Zone. I really liked it as a, a good remix for Casino's uh, the, the casino level, Casinopolis and Sonic Heroes that is on um, Team Sonic Racing and Cloud is final boss. <gasps> oh, that'd be perfect. <laughs> Robotnik just comes in like, <laughs> "What is your name?" <laughs> And you've got to learn to speak German. Okay. <laughs> oh yeah, Dr. Wiley. Ah, oh, it's a shame Buster of Maryfield is no longer with us. You know what, for the most part, Sonic does not go wrong with its music. Okay, another good thing I'm grateful for Sonic 3 Air is that we speed this boss up. Now just takes like 5 jumps instead of <laughs> 8 or 9 or whatever it was. Oh, I want Arma's gym playlist. I know Jasm's gym playlist. Off by hearts. That says Sonic's pinball options theme. May I see Jasm? Okay, this is Jasm's favourite level, so I'm gonna do it justice. Jasm's. I can do a DK rap. Or. Uh, do the Donkey Kong. Hey Riptos, how's it going? I know you're a uh, big fan of this game. <laughs> Is this Jasm's Wacky Workbench? Uh, well, I do not like Wacky Workbench. And I do not like... Well... Okay, this is nowhere near as bad as... It's tolerable, I like it, but... Wacky Workbench is... Oh, one, 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 one. Um... Hey, pets, how's it going? Stop wanking so hard, you'll get friction burns on your bell end. Merci. I'll try to keep that in mind. Uh, and yeah, if you're not following Riptos, he's doing some DayZ. If you're not following pets, um, he's doing some um, Mario um, RPG. Uh, yeah, I hope you're doing good. Shoot. I wasn't scared. Okay, I, I used to think those ghosts had beaks or were had noses, but instead it's just its arm. And yeah, I'm I so disap well, not disappointed, but you know, when I, I discovered that it's its arm and not a nose, I thought. Um, yeah, it's like finding out Santa Claus didn't exist. Well, you know, as I... <laughs> as a kid, that's... My, my well, little kid does look like a nose, doesn't it? Or a beak or, or something. But yes, it does. No. Yeah, it, it does. 
can deny it however much you want, but it is undeniably a beak-like structure. In my humble opinion. And by humble opinion, I mean me stating a humble fact. I'd be like Grumman is a crab cloud. <laughs> <laughs> but it was a crab cloud. I saw it. It's not nonsense, it's true sense. It's yes sense. Yes, pets. Now, there's no need to shout. Typing in capitals doesn't make you any less wrong. Yeah, I've not seen Grom in a while. A <laughs> wee since. <laughs> yeah, fingers crossed. I have noticed uh, Core has been streaming recently. Uh, I don't know whether he's been active on, on Core as uh, channel or not, but it would be nice to to see him and say hi. Yeah, I've not actually had a chance to pop into Cora's stream, uh, but hopefully um, I will like Cora. Um, I'm, I'm not too sure, to be honest. Um, could well be. Okay, so now we go through that tunnel of mediocr mediocrity, and now we come into a reef of happiness. <laughs> I'm a lava reef enjoyer. I'm a purveyor of a reef of lavas. Uh, if any of you guys got any plans for a weekend, uh, are you chilling, thrilling, spilling, watching thrilling? I never know if it's worth getting a lava of fire shield in this uh, level. Stick will be like here for now. I suppose it's useful for this section. to stream on holiday for the next 10 days. Oh nice! Oh, I hope you have a uh, good holiday. Waiting to see if Cumber's up for grounded, otherwise no plans, may sleep. Uh -oh. um. Ah, fair enough. I well, hope you uh, get some good rest. And hey Ink, how's it going? I'll come on in. Oh shit! <laughs> um, yeah, if you're not following uh, Riptos, he's doing some date. Have I not got a checkpoint? Oh, that's ages away, dude! <laughs> okay, it teaches me not to concentrate. Um, and yeah, if you're not following Ink, he's doing some Persona 5 Strikers. Uh, we've got Niku, who uh, was on... Ma uh, no, Pez was on Mario RPG. Niku's on Corpse Party. You know what, I'm not too upset about having to 
replay the entirety of the act because it means that we get to listen to more of this music. My first mistake was not getting the fire shield, so it would have all been avoided. Actually, it would have been avoided if A, I went for a fire shield and B, I went for a checkpoint. Uh, but yeah, I'm doing good, thanks, Inc. Uh, just discussing becoming a rap artist, just discussing, discussing my playthrough of this, which I'm currently doing blindfolded. Um, as you can see, um, if you don't believe me, that's fine. Hey Sip Muse, thanks for believing me. Yeah, everybody's been saying how impressed they are with it. I'm like, guys, that don't impress me much. Boo do do do, so you got the Isaac, but have you got the touch? Now don't get me wrong, yeah, I think seven's alright. But he don't get me out in the middle of the night That don't impress me much Boo boo doo doo Ba da 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 Ba da da Ba da da I'm trying to be I am, I am Ink, I am It's a rap jam Okay so you're Isaac Actually that does impress me very much indeed <laughs> I like how Sh Shania Twain, um, as, as, as reverent as her opinion is, um, and should be considered, <laughs> I like how she's like, oh, so you're a rocket scientist, that don't impress me much. I'm like, yeah, rocket scientist, that impresses me very much. Each to their own. What about the rest of the day? Well, <laughs> you know, the rest of the day, rest of the night, it all blurs into one. <laughs> After a while. Play Sonic 4. <laughs> I've seen Sonic 4 a couple of times. Uh, I promise next time I do a Sonic game, I'll do Sonic 4. Disgusting. Actually, it's not disgusting, it's undisgusting. It's musting. It's usting. It's usting. That's what it is. Um, <laughs> but yeah, been good, thanks. Um, well, it's been busy but productive, I think. Um, there's a Sonic Chronicles play for... <laughs> Would I get sued by Ken Penders if I did that game? Um... <laughs> I do want to do Sonic Superstars though. I, I promise that'd be okay. After Sonic Four, we'll do Sonic Superstars. Yeah, it, it's nice once. Uh, um, yeah, I've had my old friend and previous colleague from another job, Mo, join um, our firm. Um, so he's managed to take a lot of the pressure off, uh, and just having him answering emails or, or just in the, the not not the tedious stuff but the, the small stuff that you can do in like two minutes but it takes up like <laughs> a lot longer than that and then you get more stuff coming in like that that, that distracts you from the big stuff right 
so you keep putting that off as you need to dedicate a, a few hours for that and yeah so uh, I've been able to get get through a lot more of the, the, the bigger tasks that I've had piling up. Have you had your Gregs and Timmy's? Um, I've not been Gregs in a while. Did I tell you that we're getting a Gregs built? Um, where the, around the corner from my house. I'm really looking forward to that. <laughs> my wallet isn't though. But, you know, I'm gonna roll out of bed. Not even get dressed, just waltz down, down, down to Gregs and be like... Who would you hire as your assistant out of you guys? Um If I were to hire new guys Jasmine will be the office mascot Sit Muse you can be the office you you I, I think you'll be good at designing the logo so you can be marketing Niku, Niku can be my PA. Ink would be, um, I, I think Ink would be good at announcing stuff. Um, because he'd be like, well, oh, no, ink, ink can be complaints. Ink can be complaints handler. And the reason being, somebody comes in with a complaint. Let's call him Dave. And we're like, um, Dear Jeff Yard, uh, Jasm has been dancing in front of me and twerking on me. And Ink can be like, listen here, Dave. <laughs> That's part of his contract. Arch can be the uh, uh, resident um, portrait artist. Oh, no, 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 no. Fine, you don't have to be the logo designer. Um, you, can, you can create the office ambience. And by which I mean, I think you'll be able to set up a good playlist. You'll be able to keep the energy up. Um, not necessarily designing logos, but you can approve logo designs. Okay, so your Dave hangs up. Jasmine, don't hang up on Dave! <laughs> He's a paying client! Dave, you call back right now. Uh oh. Hey, fuck's sake. Does, does anybody know how to do bankruptcy proceedings? <laughs> We've just lost Dave. <laughs> Dave and his millions. <laughs> Sir, he has a move, but he has no touch. <laughs> the office ambience will be full of people shouting bitch and twerking. Yeah. It'll be like, yo bitch. <laughs> got a claim for you bitch. <laughs> Mabs, got my phone to judge bitch, you bitch, bitch, bitch. <laughs> and tell him that we've reached a settlement for one trillion dollars against Dave. <laughs> And say that if Dave doesn't pay in 28 days, then Dave can get fucked. Bitch. <laughs> and then, while we're doing that, Niku can be like, hey, Jeff Yard, would you like some coffee, sir? I actually can pour the coffee. Claim bitches. <laughs> exactly, right? And it'd be like, if you're itching, then let's get bitching. They're putting a claim today. We'll get Dave to talk. <laughs> right, Dave. Okay, anyway. And to twerk. Absolutely. Please film that ad. <laughs> I think it'd be a good ad advertisement.
It's Knuckles being a da Knuckles is very much Dave. Okay. What is your name? Twerk attorney. Uh, twerk attorney. I'd be like, twerk all day and I twerk all night. I twerk to the left and I twerk to the right. All right, all right, all right. Shoot. Okay, nice. I thought I almost flopped it up. Jasmine, you've got to twerk as well as a company mascot. It's in order. <laughs> Sonic on the Mega Dave. It was a jolty on games. Mega Dave. <laughs> Um, this is not the final fight, this is... Um, coming up to the finale. We've got sort of a few short levels, and then we've got like the main final finale. I'd say like this is the last... Well, I guess Death Egg's the last proper level, but... Because Death Egg's like the final level. I, I feel like Hidden Palace and Sky Sanctuary are beaver levels. Uh. Oh. Level is not easy on the eyes. Should we replace the lava with um, Isaac? Shouting lava, lava, lava. Shouting mega, mega white thing, mega, mega white thing, lava, 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 lava. Streets of Dave. <laughs> One massive Isaac face. Excellent. <laughs> I think so too. This is where we get to bitch slap knuckles. I always thought this uh, sort of picture in the background was like really impressive as a kid. It's like, oh, it's foreshadowing the final level. <laughs> yeah. No, it's really good visually, and uh, I think this is why Sonic 3 is my favourite Sonic game, because it does tell like a story. Jeez. Oh, you know what, me and Jasm actually played that. Uh, yeah, it's fun. Oh, this is where Robotnik tri betrays Knuckles. Uh, so, Knuckles was saying that Sonic was going to steal that emerald. Uh, and then, obviously... Robotnik steals it. I mean, Knuckles like, oh shit, Robotnik's bad after all. Follow me. So we follow him. Follow me, set me free. Trust me, and we will escape to the city from the city. And he can power up his little death egg. What is your name? Well, no, no, we can escape to a city if you want. I can escape to a city. Rolling it back. <laughs> exactly.
because in order to go forward you must reflect on on what's happened in the past, right? It's like what Rafiki says when he whacks Simba over the head with a stick and Simba's like, oh but it hurts and he's like, yes we can either run from it or we can learn from it. When he tries to whack Simba again and Simba ducks. That's what we're doing, we're going back to the city, but we've learned about the flaws of the city now. Sometimes I accidentally do stuff that I think is pretty smooth. <laughs> Any of you guys got any uh, streams planned either this week, uh, this evening, or this weekend? If so, tell me everything. I want every excruciatingly small detail, like to the minute. I want to know what your title is. I want to know what your go live message is gonna be. I want to know to a second how long you're gonna be streaming for, and. Uh, I, I want to know how how happy it's going to be. Naked? I think you're always naked to me. Smooth rotation. <laughs> Okay, so you've implemented smooth spike rotation to your Sonic and Knuckles recreation. That does impress me much. Do, 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 do. Oh, what's that YouTube channel you watch all the time? That does all like the, the specky things. Even when fully clothed, you're still naked. Exactly. I don't see clothing. I see. A human being. And when I see Niku, I don't see the name Niku Senpai. I see Naked Senpai. Yeah, so in Sonic 2 there was Silver Sonic. Oh, I think it's called Silver Sonic. I think this one's actually Mecha Sonic. And then Metal Sonic was in Sonic CD. I think that's it. Um, so yeah, Metal Sonic's first appearance was actually in Sonic CD, which would be in 92 or 93. And this was 94. The good old days, exactly. I do like this uh, design of Metal Sonic though. Again, whatever he's called. <laughs> Should we go up to him and go, What is your name? <laughs> Sorry, I'll stop saying that. I promise. Buck in mud! <laughs> what is your name? <laughs> oh, perfect. I hope that's what you're doing. <laughs> you bot, mate. I hope that's what you do in your German lessons. <laughs> yeah, I'm 
show it is. Yeah, so as a kid, because I didn't know him as Dr. Eggman, because he wasn't Dr. Eggman until in UK until like um, Sonic Adventure, right? So <laughs> it just felt so out of place seeing Death Egg, because I always thought Dr. Robot was quite menacing and not, not like goofy or anything, so <laughs> I, I guess it makes sense in like J uh, Japan where he was like Eggman, but <laughs> just seeing like he's invented this like Death Star thing and just decided to call it with Death Egg. <laughs> I also hadn't watched Star Wars either, so I, I had no idea it's a Star Wars reference. I was just calling him Eggman. Call me Eggman. You like going up to Robotnik. What is your name? You like stop speaking German to me. I don't want to die. I'm relying on Tails to... <laughs> okay, hopefully we can still do this. No! Hey, Banana Eye Zombie, how's it going? Oh, come on in. I was just showing what it's like to lose to that boss. Did I not get a bloody checkpoint before? And oh, goodness gracious. Um, so yeah, um, that's uh, an example of to, to make sure that you get all the checkpoints you come across. <laughs> but I hope you're doing well. Death egg egg shape. Blindfolded? Exactly. Well, it's not conventionally blindfolded. In the sense that a conventional blindfold would have a blindfold. I, I do not have a blindfold, but what I do have is the power of friendship that I feel will see us through. Let's cover the screen with a thick blank. I guess so. Maybe we could. Okay, hopefully let's not lose our one wing. So hoping to get a couple more hits in. There we go. Just got back from crashing the car. <laughs> washing it, okay. As long as you didn't crash it into a car wash. <laughs> but yeah, got, got to got to hear it was. Uh... <laughs> yeah, got glad to hear it was washing and not. <laughs> to say, I, uh, I did have one client who um, she had a nut allergy, and and she served uh, 
peanuts um, whilst on holiday. Um, <laughs> and uh, she sent an email that is supposed to be titled Nutology, but she titled it Butology. And she's phoning up and she's like, oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> it made me laugh, but. Oh no, that's good. It's, yeah, it's nice when you, you feel productive. Um, I get that, like, uh, when I'm sort of like piling up a, a load of cleaning and then I finally get round to it. And, uh, yeah, good feeling. This tune always reminds me a bit of um, Common People by Pulp. <laughs> Not this bit, but there is a bit in the song. Uh, you know what, actually? Uh, yeah, speaking of rain, it's been absolutely hammering it down today, so it's been cycling back uh, from work as. I, I did want to stream on the hour um, on that six o'clock exactly, but uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's so sodden. I have to go uh, get a quick shower. See Daisy. Ooh. Well, fingers crossed it doesn't rain. I'll, uh, I'll dedicate this this level to to it not raining. Fingers crossed that, that things are looked at on needs. Backwards. Okay. Here we go. Yeah, sneaky. Has it been raining in Cali? Um, I did have a. There's a Rocket League update yesterday, actually, and it's been pretty useful because it. Uh, Max, when uh, when your teammates have got how much boost your teammates have, <laughs> so that's been a, a pretty neat level update. Just enough to get it. Oh no! I thought the song that where it's like. It never rains in California, I thought that, that meant that I'd be free from rain. I, d I don't want to go Los Angeles in September if I'm going to get rained on. I'm going to avoid the rain. Now I'm going to have to suffer light rain. Disgusting. Should be a what is a Jeff Yard? <laughs> Absolutely. Oh, wait, wait, oh. <gasps> oh, uh, Niku, this is going to be the final boss. Just in case you were interested. Oh, the final set of bosses. And then, because we're playing as Sonic, as we've got all the emeralds, we get a, a secret boss after. But if you were playing normally, this. Be it. Final boss. <laughs> it's a really good set of final bosses, actually. Um, 
As a kid, I never knew that you had to hit the Master Emerald either, so I just kept hitting the nose, avoiding the laser, and, and not realising that. Nice. Hey, Kumba, how's it going? Oh, come on in. I miss music as well. I think this is like the first time Sonic's in space, possibly. Well, okay, I guess he's in space a bit in Sonic 2 when he's on going to the death egg in, in that game, but this is like his first time exposed, I suppose, to the depths of space. <laughs> Sorry, my laptop's gone off. I can't see chat, but I'm sure you're all saying, Oh, what a wonderful fact about Sonic's adventures in space. And you're welcome. Nice. <laughs> I secretly open to get to 99 lives. Some smooth rotation. Halfway to hello. Oh wow! Congrats. <laughs> hello. What is your name? <laughs> well, I'm gonna have to set what is your name to like two million points. <laughs> Meow. Woof. Me. Thank you for the uh, redeem signals. That. Uh, Okay, now Niku, this is the final, final boss. Right, no, no takey backsies after this one's done. That's the end of the game. I promise. I know it's been like, oh, it's the final boss like six levels ago. And that's true, that's the final boss of a Sonic 3 portion. <laughs> but this is a game that has uh, about ten final bosses. And each one is more final than the last. Oh, that's interesting, Cumber. Don't know what accent. What's that German accent, Move Meister? German! <laughs> what is your deal? <laughs> Don't you specker de Deutsch? <laughs> Thanks, Miku. Hey, one pint, how's it going? Meow! Wolf. Meow! Do you know Frost and Brust are my favourite German word? What does that mean? Is that like Wolf? Uh, Meow! Wolf. Meow! Um, Frost, Brust. Google is. I'm guessing like bust is like tits and frost is ass. Oh, frost is cheers! Cheers! Have I got this wrong? Is Niku not lewd?
What's Bruss gonna be? Bruss better not be fucking thank you. Or if Bruss is like, oh, you're welcome. Bruss. Okay, so Bruss is best. Ah, <sighs> you scared me. I thought, is, is somebody on Niku's account? I was gonna report you, Niku. <laughs> Your favourite German word is Schmetterling. Scheitschkopf. Okay, I'm guessing, oh, is that Scheisekopf? Is that like shit house or something? Schmetterling is butterfly. Okay. Scheisekopf. Uh, again, probably butchering the pronunciation. Shithead. Okay. So, yeah, hope you're doing well, one pine. Thank you, Move Master. I feel like I've been educated. Prost, guys. Prost. Or post. Right, let's see how I'd say that. What? Proston? Where's the in come in? Proston? No, 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 no. I see prost. I don't see any un. Poston? Google Translate's taken the piss. Do you speak German? Can you read? French gets a cool word for butterfly. Papillon. Spanish is cool with la mariposa. Schmetterling. <laughs> <laughs> that's me. Uh, that's fine. Uh, me, my style. Uh, I think I'd uh Cheap viewers Proston Shice cop <laughs> Cheap viewers let's have a a, a, a cheap ban That is for that Niku Oh shit I didn't mean to say Prost <laughs> No that's supposed to be from fucking Google What is this? <laughs> Uh, but yeah, thanks for uh, banning uh, the part, Niku. Much appreciated. What makes you think? Nothing makes me think I'm you lewd. I think that you've got many m needs. Okay. What I'm going to do now, guys, is I thought I'll legit do a blindfolded run of Sonic 1. Um. I'm trying to think how best to do this. Okay, so I'll, I'll try and show my screen and maybe... Uh, I think like maybe if I could... Okay, I'll, I'll play Sonic 1 uh, and I'll minimise the game screen if I can still play it. Oh, fuck it. You know what, fuck it, we just don't pop it. <laughs> but, yeah, uh, thanks everybody for hanging out. Um, it does find somebody to read a Rooney. We go for Rotom. Uh, she's doing some cult of a lamb. And uh, yeah, hope you all have a great day. Um, well, next stream will be tomorrow for Secret of Mana, or Sunday for Legend of Dragoon, um, and hopefully next Friday will be. Uh, Diskeo with Doom Finney, uh, but I think she's doing some karaoke tonight. Alright, <laughs> goodbye everybody. Have a good weekend. Um,
Frosten. <laughs> and for those watching the VOD, have a great day. Bye.